name is Isaac and you are watching Come Sing With Us. Welcome to another edition of Walking With The Wild. Today we are going to talk about a mammal that has been around for 50 million years. It is a large or toad ungulate. Can you guess what it is? No. How about a small clue? It belongs to the same family of mammals as horses, zebras and tapirs. Still nothing? It's a rhinoceros. Surprised? Me too. Rhinoceros are related to horses and zebras. They all belong to a group of mammals called odd-toed ungulates. Odd-toed ungulates are animals that walk on one or three hooves. Come, let's learn more about them. But before we start, click the subscribe button and the bell icon to be the first to know when we post our videos. Rhinoceros are robust animals with large cylindrical bodies, large heads, relatively short legs and short tails. They are considered to be the second largest land animals with the elephant being the largest. They grow up to 1.8 meters tall and weigh a massive 2500 kgs. That's the weight of 30 men. The characteristic feature is a large horn in the middle of their faces. The word rhinoceros comes from the Greek word rhino meaning nose and seros meaning horn. The Indian rhinoceros has only one horn while the others have two horns. The rhino's horn grows all throughout its life and is not attached to the skull. Do you know what the rhino's horn is made of? Well. It is made of compressed keratin or dead skin fiber, the same material that is found in our fingernails and hair. Rhinos are usually grey, black or brown, though one species is called the white rhino. The two rhino species of Africa are much larger than the three species found in Asia. They are also famous for their very thick skin or hide that is approximately 0.6 inches, 1.5 centimeters thick. Even though their hide is very thick, it is actually very sensitive especially to sunburn and insect bites. This is why they like to stay out of the sun and under the shade for most of the day. They also love to wallow around in mud and soak themselves in water. They roll in mud so they don't get sunburned and mud protects their skin from insect bites. Rhinos have very small eyes positioned on either side of their head and they have very poor eyesight. However, their sense of smell is so strong they can actually track each other through the smell from the trees and the ground. When the rhino catches the scent of a human or anything else unfamiliar, it is likely to charge. Because they can't see well, they sometimes charge into objects like trees and rocks, mistaking them as threats. Family Rhinos are solitary animals that sometimes form small groups. A group of rhinos is called a crass. As with a lot of other mammals we have already seen, the male rhino is called a bull, a female is a cow and the young one is called a calf. Female rhinos give birth to single babies that are born after a pregnancy of 14 to 18 months. Female rhinos produce a calf only once every 2 to 5 years. Habitat There are 5 types of rhinos, black, white, Sumatran, Javan and Indian. Black and white rhinoceros are found, are found in Africa. The others are found in Asia. Black rhinos have various habitats, but they mainly live in areas that have dense woody vegetation. White rhinos live in savannas with water holes, mud wallows and shaded trees. The white rhino is very sociable. The Indian and Javan rhinoceros look like they have heavy plates, but it is the folds in their skin that give them the plated look. and hunting. Rhinos are herbivores. They only eat plant matter such as grasses, shoots, leaves, fruits, berries and buds. They all eat a lot. The black rhino and the Indian rhino both have prehensile lips. 
they can use their left as a finger to help them pluck or gather food. They are called browsers, mainly eating from bushes, shrubs and trees. White rhinos are grazers. They have broad flat lips for grazing from the ground. Water is an important need for the rhinos. Not only do they need to drink water, they also swim in water and wallow in mud. Rhinos are very easily poached due to their drinking behavior. They, vis they visit water holes daily and while distracted by drinking can be easily killed. Camouflage Because of their huge bodies, strong horns and thick armor-like skin, rhinos have no natural predators. Nevertheless, these brilliant bees get frightened easily. When they feel threatened, their instinct is to charge directly at whatever has spooked them, whether it be another animal or a harmless object. They can move fast despite their bulk, approximately over 30 miles per hour, which is a really fast charge so predators like lions stay away from them. Interesting Facts Rhinos communicate using their poop. The choice of a meeting place is a giant pile of poop. A rhino dung pile can be 3 feet high. Rhino pictures are seen in various ancient cave paintings around the world. Though rhinoceroses were widespread in the early days, their numbers have come down drastically. Hunters kill the rhinos for their horns that are used in traditional Chinese medicine. Rhino horns on the black market sell for the same price as gold on a weight for weight basis. Rhinos may rarely hang out with each other, but they spend a lot of time with their feathered friends. They are often seen with the oxpeckers or tick birds perched on their back, which live off the pesky parasitic insects living in the rhino's thick skin. The bird's loud cries also help alert their big buddies of potential danger too. So, what do you love about rhinos? Tell us in the comment section below. Also, let us know which animal you would like to hear about next. Before you move on to our next video, give us a like and subscribe for more videos. Come sing with us! Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for more videos, music and stories.